Hey folks! Welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix a low contrast image. In my previous video, I wrote a program to compute the histogram of a grayscale image. We will use that program for today's task. This is the low contrast image. So, here we have the histogram computation program from previous video. If you haven't seen that video, I will put the link in the description. You better check that out. So, we will modify our previous program. We don't have to write everything from the scratch. In the same histogram function, I will write some code to find out maximum and minimum intensities in this image. I initialize the maximum value with 0 and minimum value with 255 After this loop is finished, we will return our histogram, minimum, and maximum intensity values to our main function. Later, we can use these values to equalize the intensity distribution of the image. For our convenience, I will write a separate function to compare and return minimum and maximum values Their code is almost the same. So, I will copy and paste and change this greater sign to lesser sign and we are good to go. We can now write our equalization function. and pass our current image, maximum, and minimum, values to this function. Now, to get height and width. The code is same as histogram function. So, we can just copy and paste the similar part. Now we can initialize a new empty image. For that we need the size of our previous image. And then create an empty image with zeros. In order to scan all pixel values, we can use the same looping as our histogram function. So, we can just copy and paste again. Now, here is the technical part. We need to calculate a new intensity value using the old intensity value and fill the result in the new image. After that, we will return this new fixed image to our main program. To calculate new pixel value, we will write another function, which we can call with ease, and write the equalization equation. We will eventually return the new pixel value, calculated by this equation, 
and put this new value at the same location in the empty image. In this way we will scan all pixel values and replace them with the new ones. Eventually return the fixed image, and save it. Now, it's time to see our result. Now, we can compare our result. Our low contrast grayscale image is now fixed. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. Cheers.